Kwingineko ni kwamba serikali za kaunti zinaweka mikakati ya kudhibiti mafuriko wakati wa mvua inayotarajiwa ya El Nino. Katika kaunti ya Nairobi, Gavana Johnson Sakaja ametangaza uajiri wa maafisa 3500 wa mazingira ambao watajukumiwa kusafisha na kuzibua mitaro na mifereji ya kupitisha maji jijini Nairobi na viunga vyake. Iliyopita idara ya utabiri wa hali ya anga ilitoa tahadhari ya mvua elino. Sasa ni kufuatia utabiri huu ambapo sasa serikali za kaunti zinajizatiti kuhakikisha wenyeji usalama wao. Katika kaunti ya Nairobi, Gavana Johnson Sakaja anasema kufukuliwa kwa mitaro iliyoziba na mabomba ya maji taka kutapewa kipaumbele. Problem in Nairobi, those who used to do environmental work were last hired in the 80s. So they have, you know, natural attrition, some have passed on, some have retired, many are above 55. They are old and they don't have the energy. And so we need to employ environmental officers who can now come who are younger between 18 and 28 who can come in and do that work. Kusina na uwezekano wa maporomoko ya ardhi na mafuriko hasa katika maeneo ya mabanda Gavana Sakaja anasema makazi ya sio salama yatatambuliwa ili kufanikisha shughuli za uokoaji mapema. As we monitor when it's when it gets close to that very heavy rainfall we'll move them either to churches we'll move them to our halls our social halls um, and we'll have to feed them when they're there we have to provide for them uh, food um, uh, mattresses we have to provide blankets but we hope it doesn't have to get to that. Serikali ya kaunti pia itatoa nambari ya dharura ya simu itakayotumika kutoa ripoti kuhusu matukio ya dharura wakati wa mvua hiyo ya El Nino. <laughs> na katika kaunti ya Mombasa serikali ya kaunti hiyo pia inasafisha na kuziboma mabomba na mitaro ya maji teka katika maeneo yenye uzoefu wa mafuriko wakati wa msimu wa mvua za kawaida. We can confirm that as we are speaking right now an area like Utange uh, has been worked on as we are speaking right now there are going to be uh, contracts um, uh, adverts that are going to be issued very soon for the areas of Bomu wakati wa zinduzi wa kitu kimoja katika kaunti hiyo uliohudhuriwa na balozi wa Ufaransa humu nchini Anod Sukwet pamoja na katibu mkuu wa shirika la msalaba mwekundu humu nchini daktari Idris Ahmed alitumia fursa hiyo kutoa wito kwa wafadhili na waisani kutoa msaada mapema ili kuwawezesha kuafikia wanaohitaji will be prepared as well in the event that we will need to be um, in a position to vacate people those who are in the low lying areas as well and especially uh, areas that have not been um, that are not formal houses per se kulingana na idara ya utabiri wa hali ya anga mvua ya viwango vya juu ya wastan inatarajiwa katika sehemu mbalimbali humo nchini katika miezi ya oktoba novemba na disemba aidha utabiri huo pia unabashiri mafuriko hasara baada ya mavuno na pia kuhamishwa kwa watu